everyone, my name is Mark and welcome to a new FIFA 21 video on my channel. In this video I'm going to show you the best way to play with Napoli, in my opinion of course. Uh, I'm going to show you the formation, the lineup, the tactics and the instructions. For of all, uh, we're going to start. I want to thank you very much for watching of course. I would really appreciate it if you would leave a like under the video. It's a small favor I'm asking, I'm thinking. I'm trying to help you guys with this, trying to help you some to win some matches so hopefully you will leave that like also i want to ask you to subscribe to my channel if you are interested in tactic videos like this for other teams because i'm making for a lot of teams these videos i'm also doing tutorial videos and also if i think there's a better way for napoli to play uh, i'm gonna upload a new video about them because sometimes my opinion in the game will change sometimes the game will change there are updates and the gameplay will change so i think uh, when there is needed to upload a new video, I will do that of course. And if you are subscribed to my channel, you are not missing that. So, we're going to start with the formation for Napoli. It's a 4-2-3-1, a narrow formation. I'm going to the lineup of Spina as my goalkeeper. Uh, he's not really better than Marat. They are both uh, similar, but I really like it that his reflexes and his diving is better than Marat. So, uh, that's why I'm choosing Ospina, but it's not that much of a difference. So if you want to choose my red, be my guest, uh, but I choose Ospina. Then the right defender is Mokwit. Uh, he's a bit faster than uh, who was there. Let me see, Di Lorenzo was uh, by default as a right defender. But because of the pace, I'm choosing this guy. Then we're going to the center backs, Manolas and Koulibaly, of course. Really great defenders. They are fast. Good at defense, physical good. So, one of, especially Koulibaly, one of the best center backs in the game. Then we have at the left side, we have Hishai. I think his name is Hishai. I really don't know for sure how to say it. But, uh, yeah, he is the best option. You also have Gulam here at the left side. But, yeah, as you can see, uh, Hishai is a bit faster. So, and that's really important in this game to have some pace. So, that's why I'm choosing him. Then we have two central defensive midfielders, Zielinski and Fabian. Then the right attacking midfielder is Lozano. Mertens is the central attacking midfielder and Insigne is the left one. And the striker is Oshi. Man. Then we're going to the tactics. I choose balance with a width of five bars and a depth of five bars. Offensive style is long ball. And I'm choosing that because you have some fast wingers with Insigne, with Lozano. Also Mertens and a striker is really fast. But uh, especially for Lozano and Insigne. In this formation you can't instruct them to go forward. But in the game they are attacking midfielders. But they are at the side of the field. We are playing really wide, wide as you can see with a width of 8 bars. And with the long ball you will trigger them to make some runs forward. When there is some space for them they will making the runs. So you can give them some high through balls. And create your chances that way. So that's why I'm choosing the long ball. Then players in the box is 6 bars. Corners and free kicks both 3 bars. Then the instructions. Uh, I choose the right defender to stay back while attacking. Uh, center backs are just default. The left defender also stay back while attacking. Then we're going to Silinski, cut passing lanes, get forward and cover center. So he's the most attacking uh, player of the two central defensive midfielder. And Fabian is the most defensive one. Cut passing lanes, stay back while attacking and cover center. Then we're going to Lozano. Only thing I change is get into the box for the cross. Mertens, the only thing I change for him is free roam. And Insigne, the same as Lozano, get into the box for the cross. Then we're going to the striker, stay central and get in behind. You can give him the instruction to get in behind. He is fast, so make sure you will watch uh, for him making those runs behind the defensive line of your opponent. And give him some high through balls and create your one-on-one -on -one goalkeeper situations with that. So that's it for Napoli. I hope you like it. I hope you will try it out. And... Of course, I hope you can win with this formation. Thank you very much for watching. Have a great day. Bye-bye.